Okay, we have an integration here from minus pi over 4 to pi over 4. So the integration interval is in opposite integer form. So opposite numerical form. This is not an integer, but they're opposite in sign. You have to check for symmetry of the function that's inside the integral. So let's check. This is how you check. If you replace the x with minus x, and if it happens to be equal to x, we know that's an even function. And an integration from minus a to a for f at x dx is equivalent to 2 of 0 to a f at x. If it happens to be like this, a minus of the original function, then minus a to a f at x dx will be 0. Okay, so let's see what this one is. So let's replace the x with minus x on this function. We get minus x squared tangent of minus x all over 1 plus cosine of minus x to the power of 4. So that becomes x squared tangent of minus x by relative angle property is minus of tangent of x. Okay, 1 plus cosine of negative x is equivalent to cosine of x by relative angle properties. Okay, so you can see this is going to equal to, right, see that right there is, right, that's right, that's the original function. So we have minus of f at x. Right, so that means f at x is odd. Okay, that means this whole integral is simply just equal to zero.